Hey YouTube, welcome to my next Subaru Forester project. Uh, as you can possibly tell from this, it is a gear sensor. So I've actually wired up the necessary electronics to tell what gear I'm in in a manual transmission. For those who aren't familiar with manuals, there are typically no gear sensors in the car, uh, so it's up to the user to get accustomed to gear positions, to know that they're in first or second or third. Um, so the the purpose of this gear sensor is mostly just for fun, it's also to help uh, beginners who I might be teaching to drive stick uh, tell what gear they're in a bit easier. Um, and yeah, so down to the details of how it was implemented. I actually have the simple mode here, which is driven entirely from signals that I get from the car. And it basically detects whether you're in some sort of gear, whether you're in neutral, whether you're in reverse and then whether the parking brake is on, and as you can tell, it's it's currently on, like so. Um, so these actually come from the body control unit, in the case of the parking se uh, sensor, and in the case of reverse. Um, this is located um, behind the fuse box. And then the neutral wire is actually something the engine uses to control whether cruise control can engage, and I believe that one was located in the engine ECU, which is just behind the glove box. So stepping up from simply reading in car uh, signals, which by the way I had to use opto isolators to do because you're going from 12 volts uh, for the car signal to 5 volts for the Arduino inputs. Um, so going from just reading those signals to detecting the exact gear I'm in, um, in this second mode, the middle mode here is off. So in the second mode here, um, actually displaying the number three required using a series of uh, switches that I mounted to this uh, sheet metal over here. Um, for example, this switch right here, let's see if we can zoom in, detects whether the gear selector is pushed down into second, fourth, or sixth gear. So as I press down in second gear, you should hear a click. In fourth gear, there's that click, and then in sixth gear. Well, there it is. So in sixth gear, it's actually the way I've bent the switch, and you can see it's pretty mangled. Um, I bent it so that it activates at about the right point. It turns out that in sixth gear, the switch actually engages as you enter neutral. Um, but that's okay, because the logic in the Arduino compensates for this kind of thing. Um, there's another switch over here. Uh, it's mounted upside down, harder to see. But that one switches when the gear selector is moved to the left. And there's a final circuit here-ish. Um, it's actually not engaging a switch, but it's breaking a connection when the gear selectors move to the right, so into fifth or sixth gear. Um, and then there's logic in the Arduino itself to figure out, based on those three switches, what um, position the gear selector is in. So I'm able to translate, let's say, a left and down movement into second gear, or a not left, not right, not down movement, but also not neutral into gear three, etc. So, um, yeah, hope you liked the video. Kind of a fun project. Uh, looks pretty cool, in my opinion. Um, I'll provide links in the description for all the parts used. Um, I think I'll also try to upload the source code. It's not very complicated. Um, but yeah, greetings from sunny Wisconsin. Uh, have a nice day. Bye.